but uh, but I know he uh, anti brought it back. But that's besides the point. Right now we're gonna get into salty fun and stir the kid Yoshi and Ness. The battle of the big heads. Big head, big nose. His nose yeah. is the size of his head. Yeah. yeah. You know this this looks like a really annoying thing to watch because they kind of both do the same thing. They don't have a lot of range, and they try to get into your zone and hit the A button, falling up air for Ness. <laughs> Or he tries to grab you and then follow up the forward air and stuff like that. Yeah, I mean, right now it's pretty even. They're just kind of floating in each other's ranges and trading. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I feel like that's how this matchup would, would uh, want to go. Oh, okay. That didn't hit, didn't hit the full uh, PK Thunder. I really have no idea how this matchup would even go, because it's just like, Yoshi gonna be doing like all of his like regular neutral stuff, which is just retreating fair mm -hmm. and uh, retreating fair. And then Ness is just like, stray hit approaching fair? That yeah. turns into retreating fair because my jump is crazy? Yeah, I feel like any if anything, this would be even matchup because they both pretty, they both do the same thing. Yeah. Just that Ness has a back throw, a ooh, kill back ooh, throw. Ooh. Like, both of their up airs are ridiculous. Man, wow. imagine if he had got that. Wait, okay, did he just break out of the egg with an up B? But, like, that was kind of weird because he was just standing on the ground. It usually doesn't happen like that. Well, I mean, like, you can act out of it immediately. So, he was just smashing. Or or he had buffered it in be uh, before. Well, wow, and he got killed for that. You know, when, you're, when your edge guard is really their edge guard. Yeah, because you know he's about to press yeah. the big button. <laughs> He's it's to, huge. About to press Nair, that big button mm -hmm. from Yoshi. Yeah, but yeah, Stir, so Stir has the slight edge, but we, but he's at 158%. I don't know why he's throwing eggs like that. I know Yoshi's like to go for that Nair at ledge, because at that percent, he would definitely just fly away. Ooh, jeez. I caught. actually like that. Yeah, he, he called he called out the whiff. He already whiffed twice in a row. He's like, well, I might as well throw out my forward smash. So. Yeah, that but was uh, some footsies. Yeah, that was definitely some footsies. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So right now it seems like Stir the Kid is a benefiting more from these trades, and then he's keeping them in the air with these PK Thunders. But then he took that risk and ate forty percent. Yeah. So this <laughs> one just started mixing him. He was like a little bit of the blender right there. Yeah. One thing about Yoshi is, once Yoshi gets like in that initial up tilt, he could get a lot of trues and fifty fifties after that. So mm -hmm. that makes that's that's what makes him dangerous as a character. Very annoying. <laughs> Also very heavy. Okay, good egg to get away, <laughs> knock away the PK Thunder. Ooh, wow. And he lived that great BI. Like, just like I said, Yoshi is a big boy. And stop doing that, please. You're going to kill yourself. Just, Yoshi <laughs> just wants to say his name over and over again. Oh, God. I feel like if he throws out another option like that, he's just going to air dodge up air, falling up air, um, stir the kid. I feel like Salty Fun's going to have to really like pay attention to the how much those moves actually physically extend because he Sir is just gonna be like, I'm gonna trade with up air. Are you serious? Like, that's all I'm gonna do. You know, one thing I really like that he just did there, he fought his way back onto ledge because you know once you get on the ledge, he could actually hit you with that down smash. And yeah, okay. Unfortunate. Um after the forward air, he did a jab which traded with the Nair. And uh, he's been trading the whole game, so that last trade is kind of unfortunate. Yeah, oh. he traded. Yeah, that was kind of unfortunate. Um, uh, the good patience by Stir, though. Uh, honestly, if I were salty, I think I should. He should just reel it back a little bit. He's 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 definitely just going in and not benefiting from the trades he's getting. Yeah. Okay, we're gonna, uh, okay, so we're gonna go to Dream Hunt. I agree with this pick. Uh, Yoshi benefits from the platforms, and. Makes me wonder though, um, why he just didn't go Battlefield? Because Yoshi's a heavy character and will have the bigger blast zones. But neither here nor there. Maybe he's just afraid of the down smash that ledge. Yeah, I mean the ledge can be really finicky. Uh, um, also, like with a stage like actually no, with a stage like this, it still would benefit Ness because like he can do the bounce thing if he needs to. Yeah, but the thing, the thing about yeah, the thing about Battlefield is though, uh, it has like the, that really weird part near the edge. Where if he does down smash, he could probably just die for no reason. You get like weird two frames and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Battlefield ledger adds. Uh, Battlefield ledger is actually terrible. But yes, it is. Like another even match. 
just been trading the whole time. Yeah, I mean, I think that's just what the nature of this matchup is going to start out with every single time. Because Yoshi doesn't, like, have strings or whatever. Uh, unless you get, like, that setup that Soldi Phone was able to get. Yeah, that, yeah, unless you get, like, that first up tilt and then yeah. you can get something started. You know, so it's just going to be a lot of just swings and stuff. Yeah. Like, Ness just gets fair into fair and then, you know, you're back in neutral again. I like that. He did he did a full hop full hop nair to not get grabbed. You know, you know something that's really interesting? When he threw out that egg the first time, it stopped Nessa's route of the uh, PK Thunder upbeat. Mm. So maybe that could be something he can exploit later on in the set if Ness goes farther off stage and tries to recover. Wow. That was actually confusing to look at. <laughs> oh oh my oh, god. He okay, so he's Okay, good jab up smash. Um I don't know if that's true on floaty, floatier characters, or that was just he just made a read. Uh, I mean, from what the Yoshis have told me, it's like always a perpetual like mix-up. Yeah. Okay. Where it's like they can jump, but uh, if they jump, then they can get up smash immediately, or they can dare air dodge it if they don't jump. It's a perpetual 50/50. Yeah. And yeah, so yeah, like we were talking about, when Yoshi gets that hit, Yoshi can get a lot of 50/50s off those hits, so it, like, it puts you in like a danger zone once you get hit once touched by Yoshi. <gasps> that was a great air dodge. <laughs> I, that, that really was. Like, you, his, his life <laughs> was 10 air dodge. Uh, you just died, yeah. Okay. Mm. So, yeah, so right now, Stir the Kid is at 93%. And uh, let's see it's, what he can. It's actually a pretty solid lead for Salty Fun. Oh, yeah. uh, you know, because Yoshi thinks is always a, like a very retreating type of approach. So, yeah, there's a bit of an oxymoron there, but that's kind of, that is what he does. So like he'll just if Salty Fun is, uh, plays it right, he'll just wait for it to like come to him, which he's not doing right now, and like trying to very aggressively edge guard right there. No, I think for the most part he's been doing the right thing because if anything in this matchup Yoshi does have more range than Ness. Yeah. So he could definitely play the waiting game and just run around, run circles around Ness until <gasps> the time no. is right. Did you no. die? Please don't die from that. Every time, every time I see somebody die from that, I get very sad. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I think. Oh, that's Ooh. it. Ooh. Mm, yeah, he was not close enough to do the nair, unfortunately. Yeah, he or she doesn't have any kill throws. Yeah, I think Salty definitely noticed the whole egg stopping the path thing, but. Ooh, he almost, ooh, he almost didn't make it. Okay, now how is Yoshi gonna take this stock right now? Because you already know when, uh, and he did like, it like that, the same way the other stock. That looks kind of true. I don't know. On Floaty, it's, it's always really weird for me when I see floaty, floatier characters. Yeah, I, yeah, that's the weird thing. I don't really get sometimes about floatier characters because, like, sometimes it can be true. Sometimes mm -hmm. it can't. Like, I don't know. It's, it's odd. But that was a, if anything, that was a great catch by Salty Fun. Mm -hmm. so. Let's see where they go next. What was that town? Did they just pick town? Is that what happened just now? Three, yep. Oh, that's definitely one, time to study. Okay. Go! Uh, this is a good, good stage for both characters, I feel like. Um, okay, he got that grab. Oh, wow. Okay, he double jumped out of that. Is that just not true at 0% or did he just um, do it I too missed late? it. What was it? He did down throw fair and he Yoshi armored through it. I wasn't sure. I wasn't sure if that was just not I mean, true at 0%. Or Yoshi. Just, uh, Deleted. Yoshi's one of those characters where it's like you feel like some things just aren't true because he just armor jumps through it. And you're just like, uh. Because it might be one of those situations where like you just. You could probably air dodge and it's like a trap. So yeah. Yoshi just jumps. And while that is more lag, uh, you still can't catch the jump because he has the armor. Yeah. Wow, he just get, went for like a nair to up smash. It looks like Fox or something like that. That's pretty Wow, he two framed with the egg. That's, that's yeah. hilarious. What a, what a cartoon character. Yeah, okay, so <laughs> Stir the Kid has been walking into a lot of those eggs. And Ooh. yeah, he's been walking into a lot of those egg lays, and Salty's been catching him for it. Um, I think that range factor from earlier in the game is really getting getting to him because he's trying to find any way to get in and Salty Fun is just like, okay, well, I have this tongue. I, yeah, command grabbing him. Yeah. The other thing that I like that Salty Fun is doing is now he's not just going for like the gimmickly like timing the sa the down B on him to kill. He's just like seeing the fact that he is kind of, uh, you know, 
getting nervous around that, just trying to get back in. And so he was able to just track him out and get that stuff him with that uh, up smash. Yeah, well, he's he's exhibiting a lot more patience, and Stir the Kid is actually getting kind of restless. He's, I think that's like four egglies in a row he ran into. Mm -hmm. So uh, maybe he can notice that. Wow. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that up air is crazy move. That definitely outranges his nose. <laughs> So 54% to 0%. Ooh. They got the grab. Okay, so that was true. And all right, there's the classic. You always have to just hold out. Because if you want, really want to just eat that third bear, then you more hold, power to you. Yeah, like, just yeah, hold out. Yeah, 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 don't hold in. Please yeah. stop it. You're not going to die. There's no survival DI needed. <laughs> yeah, just uh, don't give him the extra damage. Ooh, that was definitely up to him. That was def I know he definitely. Ooh, that was a great Ooh. catch by Salty Fun. Like, I really like the perseverance. Um, great catch. But I am up on stream next. So, uh, have a good one, my guy. Thanks, man.